Hallo und herzlich willkommen hier zum Anfang von Episode 3, der lange Weg bei The Walking Dead. Und wir konnten ja schon einige Sachen im Vorspann äh, sehen zum Ende hin der zweiten Episode. Und ich bin echt gespannt, was uns hier erwartet. Es schien ja doch wieder ein bisschen aufregend zu werden. Und ich würde sagen, nicht lang schnacken. Fangen wir an. Ich starte Episode 3. Und dann... Warten wir mal ab, wir kriegen auf jeden Fall einen Rückblick, denke ich mir. So haben wir das ja auf jeden Fall bei Episode 2 gehabt, dass wir von Episode 1 einen Rückblick bekommen haben. Und Episode 2 war schon heftig, aber irgendwie Previous vorhersehbar. On the walking dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. You've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters. And you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Kenny, what the fuck? Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Okay. Diese Spirale passt sich den von dir getroffenen Entscheidungen an. Das kennen wir natürlich. The Walking Dead. Sehr schön. Looks like this is our lucky day. I don't like it. Keep your eyes open, all right? Just trying to be optimistic. Let's just get inside. Hm. Das kennen wir schon irgendwie. Also die Szenerie von der Vorschau. made up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should stay, Kenny. We've made an all right go of it so far. That fucking figures. It's only a matter of time till you and Lily put a white picket fence around that shithole. Wir müssen ja immer noch dran denken, dass wir noch ein Kind bei uns haben oder zwei. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig into the pharmacy and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <lacht> Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. There's no safe way through that mess. Huh. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Das geht doch nicht gut. Das sehe ich doch jetzt schon. Sag ich ja. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. I better get a move on. <laughs> Lily 
Something's not doing so good, huh? She'll be fine. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. Still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon? I haven't asked. You even talk to that girl anymore? Haben wir das? So, draufstehen? Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. <laughs> Shit! I <laughs> talk. Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get off here. No! No! Go away! Go! Go! Oh, huh. Help me! Somebody help me! Hör auf zu schreien! Oh God. Oh God. What the? What the hell is that? A walker? Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Okay. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Okay, yeah, the rest. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Das wird schon eine richtige Entscheidung gewesen sein. Hoffe ich doch. Oh Mann. Immer diese Entscheidung. Es wäre gut, dass wir diesen Ort aber wir haben nicht alle Tag. Geh alles, was du kannst, aus diesen Racks. Don't forget okay. underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. She's gone. There's not much time now. Du hast neun Gegenstände gesammelt. Hoch. Da haben wir noch mehr. Sehr schön. Schön, dass du in meiner... Incoming! Come on, Lee! 
Up and over. Auf und drüber. We're still clear. Let's hustle. Oh, verdammt. Oh, verdammt, verdammt, verdammt. Hallöchen. Na komm schon. So, danke. Yourself, didn't you? Ja, natürlich. Sehr gut, sehr gut. Genug Pfeile, die könnte man eigentlich mitnehmen. Wir sind auf jeden Fall wieder beim Motel. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? Genug? Lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. Fishing. Carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, 
stealing, and I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. Oh man, eh. <clears throat> She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Also, ich glaube, das mit Lily und Ken, das wird immer so weitergehen, bis einer von den beiden wahrscheinlich stirbt. So, dann gehen wir erstmal gucken, was sie uns sagen möchte. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. What about? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. It was a lifetime ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed, and telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what'll happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. You'll thank me later. Tja, abwarten. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time. But there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. I'm gonna look into this thing. Good idea. So, reden wir mal mit Clementine. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car. And I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. You can uh, go on back to your things. Phew. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and... I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? 
Can I talk to you about something? Sure. Is everything okay? I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. You've always looked at me with kind eyes. I wonder if you could still do that if you, uh, knew I was a convicted felon. My goodness, for what? How much trouble can a teacher get into? Well, plenty. But it had nothing to do with that. It was for murder. Why? He and my wife, uh... That's were... enough. Tell me what happened when you were locked in the fridge at the dairy. I was given Larry CPR with Lily. Kenny came in from out of nowhere and put a stop to it. What did he do? He smashed his head in. Ja, wir hatten keine Chance, ne? Das dürfen wir nicht vergessen. Katja. Everything keeps changing. Puh, die Vergangenheit kann manchmal ein schneller einholen als wir denken. Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Yeah? What do you got? Ich hoffe, sie hat recht. It's serious. Okay, should I sit down? Come on. I was, uh, on my way to prison three months ago. No shit. No shit. Wasn't for touching kids, was it? No, it wasn't. Because we got two here. I killed a guy in a fight. Should I be worried there's anything else in your past that's gonna come out? No, nee, eigentlich nicht. good. But you should know, if we gotta make numbers when it comes to a boat, this is gonna matter. Alter, dieser Typ. Irgendwie regt er mich langsam auf. Hey, Ben. What's up, Lee? Hey, Ben, I need to tell you something. Sure, Lee. Is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I was, uh, on my way to prison before this. Whoa, seriously? What, um, were you in for? It's not important. Oh. Just, if you hear anything, it's probably true. And now you know. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. Sehr schön. Die nehmen das doch alle sehr gefasst, muss ich sagen. Okay, hier ist nichts. Wieso komme ich denn hier nicht durch? Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I'll believe it when I see it. So. Wir gehen mal gucken. Hallöchen. Alles gut. Ich bin sorry. Ich könnte eure Hilfe help. Es gibt einen Trader. Jemand, einer von uns, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. You haven't really been sleeping. Don't start in on that. You've been through a trauma, and you're not taking care of yourself. It counts off, and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. 
We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. A mystery. <laughs> Jesus, Doc. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. <lacht> Schöne Anspielung auf Batman. You can help. Don't tell anybody. Secrecy. Yeah, good. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. Schöne Anspielung. Aber wer soll die Taschenlampe benutzt haben? Wir gehen jetzt noch mal hoch und reden mal mit... Ich hab Carly? Ich glaube, sie ist Carly, ne? I uh, talked to Kenny about who I am. And? I don't know. Feels like I just gave him ammo, if we ever have to make any tough decisions when it comes to a headcount. Ah. Uh, well, don't worry. I talked to Katja. How'd she take it? She was fine, I guess. I think she's more upset about Kenny. Because of the St. John's? <clears throat> What exactly did he do back there? Oh, don't you start now. I talked to Clementine about things. We say ja erstmal, dass wir mit allen gesprochen haben. I don't know. She's tough to read. She adores you. Don't worry. Do you know anything about this flashlight? It's broken. I know it's broken. And the batteries might be in backwards. It uses just one. Everything should. What was the question? Did you break the flashlight? No. Okay. I uh, told Ben. You told Ben? Funny you picked him. Low risk. I take it he didn't know what to do with the information. Not even a little. He's just happy I told him something. I'll talk to you later. I'll talk to you later. Lily or um, Carly? Irgendwie. Hey, Clementine. Hm. Hey, Lee. You didn't accidentally break a flashlight, did you? No. Did Duck say I did? No. Did uh, Duck break the flashlight? I don't think so. He's just always blaming me for stuff. Like what? Putting a bug on his pillow. Did you do that? Yes. <laughs> A flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. Oh, das kann nur einer dann von den beiden sein, oder? Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot though. Okay, das ist ein Hinweis. Gehen wir mal gucken. Ach stimmt, wir kommen da ja gar nicht lang. Ach doch hier. Hm. Was ist das für eine Markierung? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. 
Okay, back to investigating. <sighs> Wir müssen wohl noch mal mit Clementine reden. jetzt befragen wegen dem X. Hey Clementine. Hey Lee. Do uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst. Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was calling the scene for clues and... Yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. Yeah, come. Cool. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No, Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Okay, ich dachte, wir haben jetzt irgendwas verpasst. Um. Have you seen any chalk around? Ah, yes. Clementine loves to draw with it. Yeah, she says she's missing a piece of it. Well, I don't know anything about that. Sorry, Lee. Irgendjemand. Aber wer? Hey Ben, I need a piece of chalk. You know where I can get any? Why would I have any? Just asking around. Well, I don't play with that stuff. I've got my... Well, my thoughts. And I've been reading the Bible I found in my room. That's what it's there for. Okay. Ich versteh's nicht. Wir müssen Lilly fragen. Hey. Find anything? I need to tell you something. Sure, go ahead. But if it's bad news, maybe save it. I was sent to prison before the plague. Shit. What? Dad said there was something about you. So you know. I didn't know what to know. Well, it's true, and I'm sorry. He treated you like shit, knew who you were, and you tried to save his life. The last thing you need to do is apologize. Thank you. You killed a guy. So what? I bet he was a dick. Well, it, it ruined my life. Good thing everyone else has got destroyed shortly thereafter, huh? Misery loves company. Ey, ich wollte doch noch. Können wir noch mal reingehen, bitte? Hey. Find anything? Oh, warum können wir die nicht fragen? Das verstehe ich nicht. Gehen wir davon aus, dass dieses nicht war? Oh, puh. schwierig, schwierig. Do you have any uh, chalk I can borrow? What, Clementine holding out on you? So you don't have any. No, why would I? I told Lily. You were right. She and Larry spoke, obviously. She was all right, though. Well, you're about all she's got left. Okay, es ist auf jeden Fall ein schwieriges Unterfangen. Ich würde sagen, wir machen jetzt erstmal Schluss für heute, beziehungsweise für diese Folge und schauen mal, ob wir denjenigen oder diejenige finden, die hier Kreide und Taschenlampe kaputt oder benutzt haben. Danke fürs Zuschauen, bleibt lebendig, bis zur nächsten Folge.